Hey, what is going on guys? So you have a iPhone XS or XS Max, gonna show you how to close running apps or basically apps that are in the background, okay? So you can see I have all these apps that are currently open in the background. What you simply do is from the bottom, you wanna slide up, okay? So bottom, just slide up until you see this. Now you can go ahead and let go. And this is the last app that I had open right here, my PUBG game. Now, if you wanna go ahead and close these, what you simply do is you can just slide up with one finger, find the app that you wanna go ahead and close, slide up. You can also use two fingers, you wanna go a little bit faster. And if you're good, you can actually do three fingers, okay? Or you can just uh, keep swiping up, up, start closing all these individually. Okay, so for example, every time you open up an app, like for instance, let's just go ahead and open up, uh, I'll go ahead and open up uh, the app store here. So I open up the app store here, and now I'll go ahead and go back to my home screen. Now if I slide up for the app switcher, you can see that last app that I opened is the app store here. Now a lot of you guys may wanna know how to close all the apps at once. Maybe you have like 30 apps open instead of always trying to close every single app like that. There is no option with the iPhone. iPhone does not provide you with a close all or clear all, unlike Android phones. So if you wanna close the apps, that's what you have to do. You basically have to do it manually. And if you always have a lot of apps open, it can start uh, making your phone like a little bit laggy because it's running in the background. Also, it can start taking some battery juice depending on what apps you have as well. Another thing too is, for example, like let's say you open up your camera app here and it freezes unexpectedly or something like that. What you wanna do is go ahead and restart uh, the app or the camera app. So you can just go ahead and go back to your home screen here, go ahead and swipe up close the camera app, then you can go ahead and go back and reopen it. So there you guys go. If you guys have any questions or any issues uh, with the, these iPhones, just comment below. I'll see you guys in the next one.